this is going to be a very specific love reading. This is for you if you are questioning if your connection is moving too fast for your partner to keep up with you mentally, emotionally, financially. This is for you if you are wondering if they feel the same about you as you feel about them. And this is also for you if there's any sort of family drama involved. That's what's coming through right now. So family drama feelings of similarities or similar feelings in question as well as are they able to be what you need specifically especially emotionally and mentally financially is also involved as well so we're going to pull some cards and find out what it is divine spirit wishes you to know at this time also i would like to say the zodiac signs that are coming to mind are aries sagittarius pisces is also coming through Mm, Gemini is also coming through. Let's see here. The, the month of March is significant as well as the month of June, July is significant. So maybe certain experiences happened with you and this person. So we have the Hanged Man, the Five of Pentacles, and the Magician. This to me is the first question that we asked. Okay, so this to me is letting me know that right now it doesn't seem like your person, like to the eye, it does not seem like your person has what it takes to be everything that you are feeling that you need at this time. Here's this questionable energy. You feel almost stuck in this connection because you have so much love for this person, but you're almost finding yourself asking, is this love reciprocated? Like, is this person putting in the same work as me or putting in, you know, giving all, the giving their all to this connection in the way that you have been pouring into it? But here with the Five of Pentacles, this is confirmed that everything that you say does not go unnoticed. Even though this person isn't able to necessarily verbalize their affirmation that they have received what you have said and that they are going to change based on what you have shared, this person is taking everything that you say and painting a new picture of what the future looks like for your connection. And here, followed by the Magician, 222 on the timer as your confirmation, lets me know that this connection is leading somewhere very special and it is as magical as you believe it to be. It carries the same magic that you felt when you first met this person. I know that at this point in your connection, it may feel like the magic comes and goes, ebbs and flows. It's not as strong as it was in the beginning, right? But that's because it's leading you to something even stronger. It's leading to you that it's leading you to this happily ever after energy. Believe it or not, this person is fully capable of being everything that you need. And I feel like it's your belief in that that is going to allow you to actually see this connection through to the future that you are desiring with this person. You also wanted to know if this person feels the same about you at this time. Everything that goes in comes out equilibrium is here within this connection with the justice card here it's like whatever you feel towards this person this person also feels towards you but you need to understand that they are going to express it in a different way than you do for some reason cats meowing is very significant kittens specifically um this could have to do with something in your childhood his, uh, his or her uh childhood um, what's also coming through is mountains. So maybe you've talked about visiting the mountains. Maybe you live near the mountains, or maybe you need to take a trip to the mountains with this person to really find a deeper connection, something about a deeper connection being made with this person. But you can trust that this person carries the same feelings for you, but it weighs differently on each of you. Like the amount that you feel, the amount of love that you carry and feel for this person is going to look completely different. Like it could be feathers to bricks here and feathers may also be significant for you. It's going to look completely different to this person because they just have a different way of loving. And so if you can see beyond the physical, even down to the actions that this person is taking towards you and feel into, intuitively feel into what this, or intuitively see into what this person is feeling, you will understand that it is equal give and take. It is equal give and take. Even though you don't see it that way, it is equal give and take because believe it or not, you are going to end up having learned just as much from this love connection, learned and received just as much from this love connection as this person. And the final card, the Seven of Pentacles. Where does this end up? There's a possibility of a broken broken home here. The broken home is coming through very strongly here. I'm going to die. 
this also could have to do with coming from broken homes i feel like both of you come from broken homes like i just broken homes is the strongest message here I think that you both experienced a lot of lack in love and you are both hoping for this love to be different. I feel like you have a lot more hope for this love than even this person. I feel like they might have given up on love a long time a long time ago, but you stayed strong in your belief of what you deserve. Whoa. Okay, you come out on top no matter what. You need to understand that. You come out on top no matter what. With the Prince of Wands, the Prince of Pentacles, and the Princess of Hearts. That's that emotional, mental, st and financial included stability that you're talking about. All for the Princess of Hearts. All for the, for the girl, the boy who never stopped trying to love. Who never gave up on love. That's what, you're, that's what you're getting. And with the King of Pentacles and the Three of Swords. This is one particular person who is going to show you all of the reasons... It's like all of the reasons why you deserve to be loved and all of the ways in which you deserve that love. They are going to heal the broken parts of you that you did not even know existed until you met this person because you've, you're you somebody who has and is doing a lot of work, has done and is doing a lot of work on your self, uh, self-worth, your, your self-concept. But this person is going to show you even deeper parts of yourself. The parts of yourself that others in your life have never deemed worthy of love. This person is going to deem them all worthy of love. This one takes the cake, ladies and gentlemen, and be prepared for a very large and tall wedding cake. Very unique wedding cake. Wedding is coming to mind. Um, at your future wedding. Oddly specific, but wonderful nonetheless. So I hope this helps. As always, take what resonates and leave what doesn't. If you do feel called still to dive in further with me, I offer personal love readings at this time. You can click the link in my bio to visit my website, and I would love to channel and pull some cards for you.